Johnny. Have a look at that, 101 centimetres. We're on. We're on. Look at that, 91 centimetres on the live salmon. Well, welcome back to another episode, guys. Down the beach again. Just letting the tyres down. She's um, been a while since my last trip because of the weather. Every time it comes to the weekend, she blows it, blows a gale and rains. So yeah, it's been a while, but finally made it down here again. She's a bit windy, but not too bad. She's blowing northwest, but. Um, yeah, good tides and that tonight. Um, and uh, yeah, hopefully we get onto a few. But yeah, we'll see how we go. We'll get these tides down, get over the beach and set up. See how we go. See you there. You. Over the beach uh, after a bit of a bit of a hassle getting it, getting up into the spot as you can see she's pretty soft here and I got me tires down a fair way but um, yeah got down here anyway it's thrown one right out and I've just set up the other one as you can see here I'm just using this reel reel I got for the first time it's a pen clash 8000 not a bad looking reel I've just put that on the pen spin fisher rod it's only um, 10 to 15 kilo I think but uh, yeah she does the job but yeah I'll chuck this one out now but yeah she's blowing a gale it wasn't too bad when I got here, but um, yeah, she's blown up now. A few showers going over, but they're only light ones, so it's not too bad. But yeah, I'll chuck out the second rod, we'll see how we go. There's um, no weed so far anyway, so that's a good thing in this weather. But yeah, we'll chuck, chuck the other rod out, see how we go. Get into them. Yo! Well. Still blowing the gale. I had one heavy shower come over. Uh, I just threw this out and um, went to set the other rod up. And she must have been hit while I wasn't looking while I was setting up the other rod. And yeah, that's what's left of the bait. So. Something chomp that. Yeah, she's blowing a gale, but there's still fish out there, so I'll keep persistent. See how we go. Yo! I've changed the hooks I use again. I'm trying these different hooks. Now, uh, BKK 10 0 hooks. I like the look of them. So far, they haven't worked for me, but anyway, I've got two 10 O's up the front now, two 10 O's and then a 8 O at the back of the tail. Perfect. Hopefully I can catch some of those fish I'm missing, but I've already missed about at least four or five tonight, so not exactly working so far, but Sometimes the fish are like that. Well, things aren't looking any better. Uh, still windy, 
and now another shower's come over. I've only had, um, well, I've had a couple hits, I reckon, while I wasn't looking. Um, but she's pretty windy. And I'm like losing a couple of baits, but yeah, nothing yet. So, um, keep chucking baits on, see how we go. You! Still windy, but at least the rain seemed to have stopped. A couple little hits and a couple big hits, but no hookups yet. But uh, the tides just started coming in, so I'm hoping it's going to start to get some action soon. Well, finally I've hooked something. It was pulling pretty hard, still is. Something half decent, maybe a sap or oh, a muller weight. Oh, a decent size muller weight too. Well, I was just about to chuck out the other rod. Whoa. And this one went off. Yeah, no wonder. Look at that. That's not a bad first fish for the night. Yo! Well, look at that, the BKK's work there. Well, all three hooks were in him. Have a look at that. Wow, that's a 75 centimetre fish there, at least. Few people ask me what rod and reel I use. Well, this um, rod is a um, Daiwa beef stick. It's, um, it's not exactly expensive. It's only it's on special from 80 to 85 to 60, uh, 75 or something, I think. But um, it's, I think it's 15 to 24 kilo or something, and um, it's the dive with Saltus 8000. Damn good reel, I can uh, recommend that. But yeah, nothing flash. But I'll tell you what, for the price, of these dive with Saltus are good reels. I'm happy with it. Keep trying. Here we go. Yeah, we got that 75 centimetre mulloway after four or five misses. And then I've had a couple baits with nothing again. Um, I think there's a lot of lice out there because the baits are not even lasting 15 minutes. So, get the bait up more often. Ah, uh, well. I just had one hell of a hit then. I was sitting up there in the chair having a bourbon. And the rod just bent over and started bouncing. And like she was 90 degree bouncing, she was a big fish. Had it on there for probably a second or two. And then she stood up, gone. And oh well, there's fish out there. 
bait I threw out uh, I reckon about 15, 20 metres It was a short cast That was a big fish, I'll do it again Any about all that That's a little cast That was a big fish I missed there oh, On again Whoa Oh, that's some bigger head shakes. Oh, what have we got? Some big head shakes. Oh, what is that? That's a big mulloway. Oh, serious. centimeters I kept persisting she's about oh, up past 12 quarter to, quarter to 1 82 centimeters on the pilly I missed so many fish tonight this one makes it all worthwhile 82 centimeters makes it all worthwhile all those hours and nothing you Look at that. Good fish. Only two fish for the night. One probably 75 to 78 centimetre fish. And the 82. Good fish. Have a look at that. Well, overall, been a pretty, pretty good night's fishing. It. it was um, pretty slow to start off with, but. Pays off. Got the fish. Two nice mullies and a big salmon. It makes the trip worthwhile. More books. Well, that was a bit of a different night's fishing. Only landed three fish, but three good fish. Probably. Getting that 82 Oregon, probably that first one was probably about 77 centimetres. Well, that was an eventful night. Only ended up with three fish, but um, they were good fish. Got um, one mull away, about 77 centimetres. Uh, another one, 82 and a half centimetres, and a five or six pound. Salmon. Pretty good night's fishing. But um, yeah, it could have been better. I reckon I lost about six, seven, eight fish. 
but oh well, we get that. But yeah, another good night's fishing. Got something in the esky to take home this time. Considering the weather I got, um, I did pretty well. So anyway, thanks for watching guys. Like and subscribe. And um, yeah, I'll see you in the next one. Hopefully really soon. Hopefully we get some better weather than we've had lately. But yeah, see you in the next one.